XT Man here, and today I'm playing the brand new game Wizards Unite. This game is made by the Pokemon company Niantic, so it's pretty similar to that, except it's basically a Harry Potter themed with wizards. So it has all sorts of wizarding aspects and magical creatures in it. So basically, about this game, is you, your whole goal for this is to register all of these fragments. You need to register baby hippogriffs, eggs, cats, all these magical creature things. Pegasuses, centaurs, all things from Harry Potter. So today, I'm going to be showing you how you can get these fragments. See this right here? This is a threat and it shows you that the threat level is low. Sometimes it can be medium or even high. And there's a battle. Yes, this is a threat it, that you need to make it so it's not a threat anymore. And then it can flee like it just did right there. Or it can stay with you and you can get it and you can get that fragment of it. So but, you're walking around, looking around the yeah. map, and having an adventure in the Wizards Unite Harry yeah, Potter world, uh -huh. and seeing what you come yeah, up against. Well, yeah, these threats and stuff. So this is an, uh, another animal. So all those things, like this is a, this is a threat level low again. And you basically, once you get it, like four fragments or whatever it is, is then you don't really need to get it. Anymore. And you have a certain amount of energy ins to get it like right now in the bottom it's 24 out of 75 you may be wondering how you get these energy you have to spin and you have to, not spin, you have to use your finger to get energy points from um, these ends or greenhouses and the ends of the energy points on the greenhouses they're rare but they give you plants ingredients and energy points and also, if Too you're going to, to right now. okay, wait, well, let's, it, let's so take an example. About flying around. Yes, so in this mode, in this game, if you go fast, yes, your character flies on the broomstick, which is a very cool animation and shows, you, shows the Pokemon that you're in a car. See? We're riding on a broomstick. Yeah, on a broomstick. pretty fun. But right now, we'll show you an example of a greenhouse to the right here. They're kind of like Poke Stops in Pokemon Go. Oh, so I may by accident call them that. But you see this? You can pick from three different plants. I'm going to pick the one to the bottom left. And then I get four screw of grass and two snowdrop. And then I can use those ingredients to bake egg. Yeah, to make potions. You also, like in Pokemon Go, you, you would have these eggs to hatch Pokemon. But in this game, you have port keys. And you can use the port keys to travel to a specific location. So for example, I'm gonna travel here, and I'm gonna tap five of these sparkly things, and then I'll get a specific reward. There's one there, there's one there, there's one up there, there's one there. Yeah, and I, yeah, and I'm in a row. Yep, in a special magical room. And once I'm done, I get a specific fragment, like I got a monster book of monsters fragment, and that is that could be something that you could only get it access to by a port key. Exactly. So yeah, yeah. So there's also in Pokemon Go they had raids. So for example, there's fortresses. So we're gonna go over to Clyde's so Park, where there's a f yeah, and also by on your way there we can and get more of these confoundables. So let's head over to Clyde's Park. Ooh, look at this. This this is a threat level low again, but uh, I do I've never seen this before, so I can get it. So I can get a fragment of it. So the better I move my finger to copy that line, the better my spell is. See? And then I got him first try, and I protected this. What did you get? Um, I don't know yet until it tells me. A baby niffle has been oh. returned to Newt Scamander's suitcase. So, yeah. And then I got one out of one fragment for that. And then I can place the image in my registry to show that I got it. Boom. Right there. So, yeah. So, now, we are going to try and defeat look, rank four in the fortress so i think i'm gonna act activate so now you're doing a battle yeah now i'm doing a battle 
I think. And the point uh, of doing the battle is to earn things yeah. to level up. The point of doing the battle is to level up. So I'm gonna go for level one Legends of Hogwarts Rip. And I'm gonna and the battle is gonna start in 16 seconds. And I'm using level one because rank four is pretty hard to beat. Eight, so I don't know if my character can do it, but we'll have to try it very, very best and try and protect ourselves as fast as we can. But see, now it's gonna start. I wonder if there's any potions I can activate. Here, one second. Ooh, potion. See, I can go to my potions. Um. Uh. I'm pretty sure I had other potions. But anyways, I'm gonna start fighting by lowering this guy's stamina. Stamina. Uh, and def try and defeat a common dark wizard. So, I have to line it, and then, yep, line up the three stars, and then I'm gonna have to fight him. And my health throughout the whole match, I'm gonna have to defeat two wizards, so I need to make sure I lose as little health as possible, because my health is gonna forever carry through the two battles that I do. So your health is the green on the left side? Yep. And this is on the right side. And right now, there's a comparison difference of 104 to 86 right now. So it looks like he started with more health, so I'm doing more damage and protecting better. So we'll eventually defeat him. But the, my problem is with the next battle, I wonder if we can defeat that guy. Because this this health can carry on out to the next one. Yeah, two bad guys I have to defeat. So just in case right now, I'll show you an example. I can use a potion like this to heal 35% of my damage. So I'll use that, and I'm nearly back to full up here. And that's so, a potion that you mm -hmm. mixed beforehand, and it took out two hours to yes, activate. Yes, exactly. And I needed, I ingredients. found all the ingredients on the street by roaming around. But it, yeah, it was hard to brew. Now I'm gonna defeat this werewolf by trying to defeat him. I, I lowered, I used one of my spells. I was on him, so he's gonna be a little lower. But he's still pretty hard to beat. Oh, what is that? A werewolf. A common werewolf. <laughs> Hopefully I don't die here. I can see my health went up to 125 out of 128, so I'm almost at max. But will that be enough? Because this guy looks pretty strong. Okay, he's almost at the same health that he started at. So, nobody around After this, I will be around. So maybe if I win this, I can maybe use it. This Cornus Pixie, and then I won. At first, I'm gonna lower his stamina, stamina or health, and I'm gonna heal myself for 35%. This again, a potion you yep, an another. Po yeah, it's a potion that took two hours to brew. So, yep. Uh huh. Ooh, it's a pretty good health difference. Can we? Do it? Oh, it's looking good. It's looking good as long as he doesn't do it. See, I hit him twice. That's a good slot. Okay, sometimes he can hit him twice or he can three times. Okay, so that would be unfortunate though. Okay, I can hit him again. He doesn't have a second try. Looks like he's gonna be pretty good. He's at 18 health, and I'm at 98. This is gonna be pretty good, guys. This is a level 4. Oh gosh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go! Success! And you may be wondering, why do I wanna win this? Like, what's the point? You'll see right here. I got four fragments on on the Mad Muggle book, and I upgraded my chan. I upgraded my rank, and I got XP to level up. So this all gives you rewards that you can use to make more. Oh, yes, yeah, become a more powerful wizard, increase your stamina, uh, access things. Yep, or or a side. 
You can either choose a professor, a magicologist, or an aura, and we chose the aura because it's the best at spell casting. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you want to see more of this game, hit that like button. We'll end it by an opening this port key right here. Let's see what, where we go. Ooh, in this house? Okay. And if you think these, these port keys are pretty lame, I got a portrait of Voltamart once from this. Right, Ma? So yeah, you have to look all around. All around. Collect. I'm turning my screen like is crazy it right now. Is it on a timer? Like no, you, you just have to collect time. five ones. Here we go. A prophecy record. You know those things that, it, yeah, those glass balls that show your prophecy that Harry wanted? Yeah, we're that's an example of like Harry Potter, yeah. That's so, cool. yep, that's that's basically right, the well, poor piece. Well, yep, happy gaming, Storm666, C.